So you guys, if you've been following this project with me, you know this was a two flat originally. So two units with three bedrooms and we turned it into a three unit with three bedrooms per floor. So we had to turn the second, the third, the basement rather into a uh, legal unit. So we had to build this structure. This was all wide open. And this took a lot of creativity from the team to figure out how this was going to work because the stairs were real funky coming down here. The stairs were real, real funky. And when we were trying to, we were trying to create a doorway coming down the stairs and making a doorway entry for the third unit to be right here. And we just didn't have enough swing room when you had the duct work and the pole and things of that nature. It just wasn't working. And then one of the framers, God bless him, had the bright idea to not try to make the entryway to the unit here, but to move it over here. And so why this became an issue is because this is the main water service and the city doesn't want to have to come inside a unit to service the property for the water. So it was either relocate this outside, which could have been about ten dollars to $15,000 to do. Instead, we built a little room. So if you can envision it, if the city can kind of come in through the door, they can walk down the steps and they're in this little room. This is the entryway for the, the, the third, the basement unit. So this would be a door and the city can come right in here without going into the unit and they can service the water meter, et cetera. So great idea. So as we walk into the unit, you can see some of the work, Get all this dust on the floor from them sanding and finishing, mud and taping. It was pretty remarkable uh, how quickly the guys came in here and drywalled this. But you can see we got can lights in here. This is the basement unit. This is their living room area. We'll walk in. There's three bedrooms per unit. The bedrooms are pretty spacious. This is one bedroom. You can see nice ceiling height. Nice closet. You got the second bedroom over here. Same thing. Nice closet. And then you got the third bedroom over here. So yeah, a three bedroom basement unit, man. I haven't seen many three bedroom basement units. I've seen ones and twos, but not a lot of threes, but this is three. And we got the bathroom. It's coming along, man. Hopefully it should be make it look a little prettier pretty soon, but the crux of it is in there. Shout out to our designer, designs by Carla for her work. We're in the kitchen. Nice light fixture, Carla. So pretty spacious kitchen. Next week, you'll see the, the cabinets and the uh, uh, countertops and the appliances coming in pretty soon. And as you walk out of here, this is where the laundry room would be. We'll have on-site washer and dryer, real neat. Doesn't take money, takes a, um, they'll be able to pay by putting money on the app and paying that way, so pretty slick. Um, and then you got the utility room where the furnaces and hot water tanks will go. So yeah, this is the, the basement unit, man, so it's coming along.